All right, uh, just a super quick add-on to the video I posted this morning on the trade recap. This is just going to be a daily recap because um, even though it's not 4 o'clock yet, um, the day is essentially over as far as the trading day. So it's, uh, And also the trade would have fully played out at this point had I kept it. Um, but important to note, right, my overall bias from this morning was correct like i wanted to see this as the draw on liquidity these equal lows now on nq we didn't take them okay but on es these equal lows were taken beautifully same concept of the sweep here actually es didn't even um if i was trading es i probably would have probably would have been a bullet uh bullish it probably would have been a profitable day because genuinely I don't there wasn't anywhere to get in here so I wouldn't have been in this chop and so earliest I would have entered would, would have been here now would I have loved entering with these equal highs in play no so I probably would have given it a little leeway there and again these equal lows which was the liquidity I wanted to see get taken that would have been targeted now that's a perfect scenario right um another target i would have used would have been this because this was the trading range so targeting like if there's a fair value gap somewhere in there or something interesting uh yeah, I mean, probably would have targeted something like that first. That would have been first take profit, and then, but yeah. So that was ES. So ES played out to perfection, and Q stopped a little bit short of the draw on liquidity, but it played out. I just got in before choppy price action, and I decided I was going to get out near break even because it was chopping around. And normally, when it chops around, you get stopped out, right? So. I gave it plenty of time to play out, gave it a lot of breathing room. It is what it is. Um, again, chopping is somewhat expected because it's the day before CPI, but um, obviously I had everything to get in here based on my model, so I was just hoping not to get chopped around. Clearly, I did get chopped around. Um, and then it made its move at like very late AM session, close to noon. It was a, a little bit of a weird day. Um, uh, of when it decided to make its move, but um, yeah, so that was the daily recap there. I mean, again, drawing liquidity was correct. Okay, there was an SMT here because ES took it and Q didn't. Okay, but this trade, had it not been so choppy when I initially entered, would have played out for in my favor. Um, And again, the model was there, so I'm going to take that. I'm going to execute. This is what it is. Um, but yeah, now, I mean, the day is ending fairly positive. We'll see if it closes above um, the the uh, fair value gap here. And then we'll see what tomorrow does, because I'm not trading tomorrow. I'll just sit on my hands and kind of see what it, what it gives us for, th for Thursday. But yeah.